So now that we know how to use functions, let's go back to sheet one and put some functions in our sheet here. Let's start out by totaling up the sales. So let's click here below pat. Now let's type in the word total. I'll tab over under January. And I'd like to put the total for all of January's sales here in cell B6. All right, here I go. Equals the sum, open parentheses. Now where's my range? B2 colon B5. And see the little blue box pops up there and shows you your range. Close parentheses and press enter. And there's my sum. If you have an older version of Excel, by the way, if you have Excel 2000 or 97, you may not see all the little colored boxes pop up, but the sum function works the same no matter what version of Excel you have. Let's go ahead and do February. Equals the sum of C2 colon C5. Close parentheses. This time I'll press tab instead of enter, and there we go. Now I'm over to March. Equals the sum of, this time I'm going to use my mouse, click and drag out my range instead of typing in those numbers. And one more. Equals the sum, open parentheses, and there we go. And there I have it. All of my sums to the total of sales for each month. How about we get a total for the sales for each sales rep? Let's come over here and sell F1 and type in total and press enter. Notice something interesting happened. Excel sees total going up across that first row and thinks, rightly so, that it's another header for one of my columns. So it applied the format for the columns next to it to cell F1. Generally, this is a good thing. All right. Now we need to put in formulas to figure out the total of sales for each sales rep. Instead of having our range go down the column, it's just going to go across the row. So here we go. Equals the sum, open parentheses. In this case, it's going to be B2 colon E2 and close parentheses. Enter. And there we go. Let's do the next ones. Equals the sum. Open parenthesis. Select my range and press enter. See how I think it's a little bit easier to use the mouse to select these? Even though, yes, I am a keyboard freak, some things are just easier with the mouse. Equals the sum. Open the parenthesis. And then with the mouse. Highlight it and select it. Now, for the grand total, this total down here, a total for everybody and for all the months, you can pick whichever one you want. Summing up the columns should be the same as summing up the rows here. I'll pick the column. Press enter, and there we go. One last step, I'm going to click on this and bold it to make it stand out. And I'll scroll back over to the left here, and there we go. All of our totals are now in place.